This is truly a beautiful sight. Yesterday, I pretty much spent my entire day reformatting the Hackintosh. Uh, I also spent some time getting my stuff together because I am actually going to school tomorrow, which is awesome. Reformatting a Hackintosh is a pain in the butt because under normal circumstances when you would reformat a Mac or reformat a PC, you just put in an install disk and you wipe the drive and then you reinstall and you're done. Hackintosh, you wipe the drive, you install, and then you just go through billions and billions of uh, kext files, which are kind of like the Mac equivalent of drivers, trying to figure out what you need to make things work. I actually had everything up and running very quickly, except video wasn't working quite right. I finally got it to detect both monitors, which took a long time. And when it, f when it, when it did that, I looked in my little about thing. On a Mac, you come up here and you hit about this Mac, and then over here you go to more info. And then down in the graphics, um, it was not showing that my video RAM was 512, it was showing 128. So I spent like four hours trying to fix that. And I did, which is awesome. Things are, are running really great. Um, I already got Final Cut, uh, the Final Cut suite installed. ZS4 is back. Um, I'm downloading a GarageBand update right now, and then as soon as that finishes, I'll be able to install Office, and, you know, everything is... It's going really well. I'm also up uploading a vlog, but that's less relevant. The main reason for the reformat was not that I needed space, although dear god did I get some space back. The main reason was that I was having a severe memory leak issue, and I don't know what the heck was going on, but uh, it was actually so bad that when I started my computer I had to open all of the programs that I thought I was going to use, because if not, after just like 10 minutes or so, I couldn't open any programs. And if I wanted to open something, I'd have to restart my computer. That's a pain. I've been testing it and I think everything works. So my computer is actually better now than it's ever been. And I'm really, really pleased about that. But the other thing that's going on is I'm trying to pack up all my stuff because I am going to school tomorrow. So I got some of my stuff out here. I got the 360 and the, the tripod, the TV, and the. Uh, Steadicam. Obviously I got a, a lot more. Most of it is just computer stuff and I always do that last so that'll probably be the most stressful part. My room is kind of a junk hole uh, and I gotta get some of the stuff out of here but uh, not all these boxes are mine. I'm not taking this back. We do not play rock band. I mean when I got it we did for like a month and then that kind of died. Although I did figure out that you can hook up your rock band drum set to your Mac and use it in GarageBand, which was awesome. Unfortunately, it was only awesome until the douchebag that lived below us was pounding up on the ceiling, and I had to stop doing it after that. But it is cool, so if you ever want to do that, you can. Uh, right now, we're going to go to get something to eat, and we have to go to Walmart. Uh, not necessarily in that order. Just get some last-minute stuff that we'll need for tomorrow. And then tomorrow, we travel to Savannah, Georgia, and I can move in on Saturday, which is the day after. But we're eating at Snooky's like me and Mal did that one time during the summer. And this is really for Mal, I guess, because Mal really wanted to come back. Uh, and we never did. So I, I wish she was with us so she could have her salmon BLT again. But I'm going to have to eat one for her. But just one, I don't think I could eat two. It's a little much. Man, that looks good. There's salmon under all that bacon. Because uh, she wanted the same thing, but obviously she's not going to get bacon. I get the bacon. And I love extra bacon. And you get a burger. So you don't, you don't count. No more TV. No more Xbox. No more a lot of the stuff in this room. In my room. I'm getting a lot of stuff packed up, which is really good. And you know I've been working on the computer and getting everything set up and such. Uh, things are mostly back to normal. Everything's working and it's really, really good. Whenever I was moving stuff from before to after, um, I actually found motivational posters folder. I don't know if you guys recall, not too long ago in the vlogs, whenever people were making motivational posters and sending them to me and I was updating them. Well, apparently there was a few I never showed, which is really bad. I should show them. Um, so I'm going to show them all right now. We have Dan. He is always waiting for the opportunity to hug you. Alex would very much like for you to continue. Continue! Steven, 
he really likes ranch dressing a lot. And then we have another one by Tiramisuki, who did Cat Hat. He does not like spray adhesive. Sorry for you guys, uh, I, I didn't even realize I stopped showing it. Anyway, I have a much, 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 much better suggestion for you guys. Instead of making uh, motivational posters and sending them to me, since I will inevitably forget about them, I want you to do this. Go to your browser of choice, in this case for me it's Firefox, go to Facebook, head on over to my Facebook fan page, which you can find you know, down there in the description box, and upload the motivational posters or whatever ridiculous stuff you have as uh, fan photos. And that way, they'll all get put in one place where people can look at them. Because otherwise, if you send them to me, they get put on the screen for a few seconds, and then, you know, they're gone. And if someone missed that vlog, they won't get to see them. However, if you put them on this fan photos thing, then they're all in one place. People can go through and watch them and look at them and stuff like that. So for anyone who has ever sent one, feel free to put them on there. Um, and for people who haven't made some who want to make some, we'll go do that. That's fine. Uh, hopefully we can get some pretty cool stuff in there. Um, it can be related to me, any videos I've done, any projects I've done, uh, obviously the vlog, uh, so feel free to include, you know, Dan, Alex, or whatever, um, against their will. I'm showing you this now because I'm about to shut down my computer and take everything apart. It's probably what takes me the longest because I got... The tower, a crap load of cables, I got two monitors, uh, the subwoofer is kind of big, there's two speakers, and, and you know, lots of stuff, so, yeah, um, I'm gonna go ahead and take this down, but uh, tomorrow I go to school, so, tune in, it should be a fun-filled day.